It is the year 2387. Mankind's most successful off-world colony is the planet Morris, a world so Earth-like that many call it Earth-2. But the Morissians are in danger, for the Noza, a savage warrior race from a distant star system, have embarked upon a campaign of galactic domination and enslavement, and Morris is their next target. The colonists' only hope of salvation is the zillion weapon system, three guns of unknown origin energized by a mysterious substance which cannot be analyzed or reproduced and is therefore irreplaceable. But one thing is certain, the molecular disruption beam of the zillion gun is far more powerful than any weapon devised by man. The three Mauritians who will use the zillion guns are an elite fighting force called the White Knights. As I'm sure you know, Mr. Minister, this research center is the only one of its kind on Mars. <laughs> and the most expensive. Stopping the nose is our top priority, and we're developing the weapons that will do it. We must continue, whatever the cost. No other colony has anything that compares to our level of sophistication and technology. Thank you. The weapons we're developing will not only provide protection against our enemy, the Noza, but all of mankind's enemies. Believe me, I am well aware of how crucial your work is here, and I'm certain that the funds will be forth... What's that? So easy on you now. Ready when you are. Hey, how you doing, champ? He's a little slow, but he's learning. I'm sure he'll figure it out eventually. What? Is that so? Tell you what, I'll take tomorrow's session and see what I can do. So I'm a little slow, am I? We'll just see about that. JJ, are you all right? I'm sorry, I didn't mean, huh? He's not a kid, he's a soldier, remember? Good session today, JJ. You're coming along fine. But right now, you better get down to the med center and have yourself checked out. Wait a minute, our session isn't over yet. You can't chicken out now. I demand a rematch. I guess she must hate me. Stop feeling so sorry for yourself, JJ. She likes you a lot. Well, if that's true, she's got one hell of a way of showing it. White Knights, report to battle stations.
research and development facility is under attack. At this point, all communications with the facility have been cut off. Gotcha, Chief. But tell me something. What's this old geezer have to do with it? JJ, that old geezer happens to be our Minister of Science and Technology. <sighs> Important guy, huh? Important? You bet he is. If it weren't for him, the Zillion weapon system wouldn't exist. He's the one who found it and one of the first to suggest the formation of the White Knights. He's a brilliant man, and we can't afford to lose him. Unfortunately, he was on a tour of the facility when the Noza attacked. The Minister and a few others survived the first strike, and your mission is to get them out. We've got a reconnaissance squad in that area, and we'll be sending in reinforcements just as soon as they're mobilized. Terrific. When I get back, how about a movie, eh? Oh boy, Champ and I just love movies. What I had in mind was, um, just us. Ah! Hold on, you guys. We got a couple of stiff inversion layers to get through. Oh, really? The computers within that facility must not be damaged. Yes, boy. If their Zillion weapon system can be neutralized, most likely the method would be programmed as a function within their weapons research computer. Their primitive binary codes would be easily broken, and then Maris will be ours for the taking. Bring him back. Yeah, so what? At least I could have nailed the sucker that then did the it. Then the Noza would know we're here. Hmm. All right, let's go. Listen. Hmm? Look. Cover me, guys. <laughs> hey, are you all right? Yep, thanks to you. Ah! Oh, no. Looks like our favorite hero is in trouble again. Yeah. Hey, cut it out! I can take care of myself! Well... <laughs> Idiot! You did it again! Did what again? I was trying to save that guy's life. I felt sorry for him. You felt, but you didn't think. Uh, now Perhaps listen! Perhaps gentlemen could meet each other up a bit later. Right now. I'd greatly appreciate your help. Right. The Noza won't know what hit him. Huh? Let's go! This is a rescue mission, not a raid. You think the Nose are gonna greet us at the door and let us in without a fight? No, of course not. We'll find another way in. But that'll take time. So, now look. And didn't We've I hear a... you say right now? JJ! Have you two gone crazy? A frontal attack is too risky. We've gotta have a plan yeah, Sorry, can't attack. hear you. Wait, JJ. Champ, where are you? He's still alive. Hold on. Only a few left alive, hiding on the west side of the uh, uh. Damn. We'll wait for Apple to join us, and then we'll move in. Look, we're not gonna get through those doors by sitting around here waiting for her to show up. Let's get to it. All right, you got it. Well, champ, it looks like it's just about that time. Right! Yeah! By the way, remember that bucket of water in your head? Yeah, what about it? Apple didn't do it. I did. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Right! The rescue ship is on its way. It'll be here in just a few more minutes. But what about the ones that are still inside the facility? Yeah, there are at least a dozen guys in there who didn't make it out. Don't you worry, we'll get them out. <coughs> That's right, we will. <coughs> Apple, do you read me? What is it, Dave? If you don't invite me to that party you're having down there, you're gonna hurt my feelings. Oh my, I forgot how sensitive you are. Please do come. Dave, hurry, will ya? On my way.
one? The computers are going offline. That explosion must have triggered the automatic self-destruct system. You must order an immediate evacuation of the facility. Evacuation? Are you sure? We have no other choice. None at all. Yes, but, Mr. Minister! The self-destruct sequence has already begun. Self-destruct sequence? Yes, in less than 10 minutes, I'm afraid the Weapons Research Center will be totally destroyed. I would never have sent the White Knights in if I had known that but such the a... the White Knights are the only ones who can save the Minister of Science. We had no choice but to send them in. There are 10 minutes left. We can only wish them luck and hope for the best. Code Red Emergency Channel, Amy. We've got to let them know about that self-destruct system at once. self-destruct system which is triggered by any breach of its auto security. We have nine and a half minutes to evacuate all Jen, personnel. cover me. I'm gonna try to find those survivors. JJ, hold on. Turn on your radio. Didn't hear it. Apple, what are you waiting for? Get aboard! JJ's radio is on. Come he on. never heard the code red. I'm going in after him. If we're not back in time, leave without us. But you've only got six and a half minutes! Only six minutes to go. Hey, you guys, what are you shooting at me for? I'm on your side. Prove it. Huh? Damn it, do I look like a nosy trooper? I'm here to rescue you. How about showing a little gratitude? It's about time. Gee, I'm sorry we're late, but the rush hour traffic was just murder. Huh? Murder, get it? Idiot. Huh? Ah, get down! JJ, we gotta get those people out of here. There are less than six minutes left. What do you mean? I'll tell you about it later. There's no time to explain it now. Just get those people out to the rescue ship on the double. I'll cover you. Now move out. Whatever you say. All right, you heard the man. Let's go. Hey, old timer, this is no time for a nap. Mm -hmm. Don't call me that. That sure got you going. You must try it sometime. Join the others and get up to the roof as fast as you can, and no naps along the way. What a fun guy. Huh? Mm. Now they know where we are! You said to go to the roof when the elevator's faster than- Yeah, but the nose will be watching the elevators. We've got to find another way. Get down! Uh -huh. Go down! Hold on. Oh no! That way. Those doors aren't going to hold. Quick, over there! Sorry, 
it, Chief. I'm just too busy to talk right now. Apple, wait! Listen to me! Apple! Apple. Isn't there anything we can do? I'm afraid it's too late. There's a door on the other side of this section that leads to the roof. <laughs> Come on. Sorry, I can't go another step. You can't give up now. Morris needs you, sir. The switching circuit must be blown. The door won't open. Stand aside. Away from the door. Huh? Uh-oh. Oh. Of all the times to run out of juice. Take cover! you'd know. What? Smart move. Whoops. Stand back, everyone. Dave, what's going on out there? The remaining personnel are on the roof, sir. I'm picking them up now. But I don't see any of the White Knights. On board. We'll cover you right now. Come on. What are you waiting for? Go on. It's too far. Oh. All aboard. Ah. These creeps just don't give up. Tell me about it. Yes, ma'am. Huh? Wait up! Now or never. All right, take her up. Where's JJ? I thought he was right behind me. What's he doing? Playing hero again. What else? Now, JJ! On my way! Just in time, we have 42 survivors aboard, including the minister. ETA, 38 minutes, sir. Say, Apple, it looks like you're a little lopsided. Huh? Nothing personal, but I don't remember you looking that way before. Huh? I don't know what you... Ah! <laughs> My little friend, I forgot about you. How you doing? Or me! <clears throat> you risked your lives and the zillion guns, and Apple disobeyed a direct order. Sorry, sir. 
Tiger. Now hold on just a minute, Chief. I can understand why you're angry. But if it weren't for Apple's courage, we wouldn't be here. If you ask me, she deserves a medal for what she did out there. I agree. You're absolutely right. <gasps> Apple, the Minister has awarded you the Mauritian Special Military Commendation for Bravery. One of the highest honors to be awarded in the history of the colony. Oh my! <laughs> what? That's not fair! Huh? I had to babysit that old man every step of the way! And she gets the medal! Stop!